used in playing golf. Uh, I chose this topic because uh, I love to play golf and um, I like to kind of share my passion with other people. So um, I guess the, the first main thing, there's probably four main categories of golf clubs that um, are used by most golfers. Um, the USGA, which is like the governing body of golf, allows you to carry 14 clubs. So the first uh, type of club is a, a wedge. And usually most golfers carry probably about three wedges. Um, typical uh, wedge has, this wedge right here has a loft of 60 degrees, which basically means if you took a line straight up from here, it's 60 degrees bent backwards. Um, wedges have the shortest shafts. So typically wedge is thought of as the easiest club to hit because not only is it the shortest club, so you're closest to the ball, but the more loft a club has, the more backspin is put on a ball, and the more backspin is put on it, the less side spin is put on it, so it's less likely the ball to go off to either side because there's more backspin, less side spin. So a uh, typical bag carries about three wedges. Um, I have a 60 degree wedge, a 56, and a 52, so those are like pretty close in distance, but one of them I might hit if I'm 100 yards away, one of them I might hit from 110, one of them from 120. Uh, golf, you got to be really precise, so you need different lofts to hit at different distances. Uh, the next group of clubs would be irons. And a typical uh, set of golf clubs would have about six irons. You would carry anywhere from a nine iron, which is only probably about an inch or two longer than a wedge. But it has, this nine iron right here probably has about 44 degrees of loft. So this will hit the ball for me about 150 yards as compared to the 60 degree wedge which hits at about 100 yards. So just that 16 degrees difference hits the ball about 50 yards longer. Um, once you get further down the uh, set of irons, this right here is a five iron. You can tell the, the length of the shaft is a little bit longer, which the longer the shaft, the further you hit the ball. And then you can just see the difference in the loft. The five iron right here probably has about 26 degrees of loft as compared to the 44 of the 9 iron. So the 5 iron is going to hit the ball a lot lower and it's also going to go further because it goes lower. Whereas the 9 iron is going to hit it higher but not going to go quite as far. And uh, the third set of um, different types of clubs you could use would be woods. Uh, I carry four woods in my bag. Uh, this right here is a, a three wood. Uh, this three wood right here has 15 degrees of loft. And if we compare this to the, the five iron, you can tell the, uh, the shaft length is a lot longer. So typically the woods are kind of harder to hit because the longer the club gets, the further you are from the ball, the harder it is to hit them. But it's also going to hit the furthest. The five iron, I could usually hit maybe about 200 yards. Three wood right here, and then probably like 260. So um, it hits a lot further, also a little bit more difficult to hit. And uh, then another type of wood would be the driver, which is used uh, on your first shot for most holes. It has a really big head, and this driver right here has eight and a half degrees of loft, as compared to the 15 of the three wood. So it's just a little bit longer. Um, doesn't hit the ball a lot further than the three wood, but it has a bigger sweet spot because the head's so much bigger. There's more area where you can hit the ball and still uh, make good contact. And then, last but not least, probably the most important club in the bag is the putter. Uh, most golfers call this like the money club because this is where most all the scoring is done. You can hit the ball really poorly in any given round, and if you make putts on the greens, then you're still going to score well. Uh, there's lots of different types of putters. You'll see different people that use putters with funky looking heads and anything. Putting is probably like the most uh, unique thing about golf. Like, you can putt a majority of different ways, and as long as you get the ball in the hole, it's not uh, not really as important if you have good technique. Uh, so that's a little bit about the uh, different types of clubs. There's also some other tools that uh, are used by golfers um, to uh, score well. This is a range finder, and basically what this is, you look through it and you point it at the pin, and you hit the button, and it gives you it lasers the distance between where you are to the hole. So it's really helpful because you always know your exact yardage. Um, and uh, that's about it. Um, so basically in, in golf, there's lots of different types of clubs that are used for a lot of different purposes, but um, all of them serve different purposes. Uh, the overall goal is to help you
you score better. So that's it. Thank you. All right.